there's something wrong with Lathe and Kerbal Space Program. When we go to the wiki page of Jules' closest moon, you will find that the liquid in its oceans is actually water. Which is weird, because Lathe is quite far away from Kerbal. So we would expect Lathe to be too cold for liquid water. We can actually check what the surface temperature of Lathe should be using an equation. And don't worry, I'm not gonna bother you with the math too much. Using this equation, we would expect the surface temperature of Lathe to be about 128 Kelvin, or minus 145 degrees Celsius. As a reference, that is about 7 degrees colder than the freezing point of butane. Do with that what you will. So how come the oceans of the Lathe are still liquid? Well, Lathe's wiki page actually has an idea. The oceans contain salt and proposes that this salt is actually sodium chloride, also known as table salt. If anyone has an idea of other possible salts that are in the oceans, I would love to hear that. The question that stares us in the face right now is, how much salt must Lathe's oceans contain? Well, you can google how much salt is needed per liter to decrease the freezing temperature by a certain amount. Turns out that you decrease the freezing point of water by about 2 degrees Celsius for each mole per liter. But what is a mole? A mole is an amount of particles, like the number of molecules for example. In this case, each mole of salt weighs about 58 grams. So, 145 divided by 2 is 72.5 moles per liter needed, which is 4.2 kilograms of salt for every kilogram of water. So, it's basically salt with water, not water with salt. So that's so much more salt than water, that lace oceans are more like salt flats than actual oceans. So KSP2 developers, do what you will with this information. In the meantime, I just started doing these kinds of videos. I don't know if I should focus on the science or the gameplay when it comes to KSP. I would love to hear what you prefer. But for now, see you next time and maybe watch another video of mine.